Sneaker collecting has grown in popularity over the last decade. This has increased the resale price of sneakers and created a scalper problem. Sneakers on the secondary market frequently sell for twice, triple, or even quadruple their original price. Collecting sneakers has become a status symbol and something out of reach for the common individual. The sneakers on this list are the most expensive ever sold. All of these sneakers were sold at auction or through private sales and do by major auction houses such as Sotheby's and Christie's. Surprisingly, the majority of the most expensive sneakers were worn by Michael Jordan at important moments in his career. The other sneakers in this list were either limited edition or one of a kind. If you like your sneakers, then you are going to love this list. The 1992 Olympics were a breakthrough year for basketball, earning the team the title Olympic Dream Team. Of course, the legendary Michael Jordan was part of the team. Jordan wore a unique pair of Nike Air Jordan 7S, which Christie's auctioned off for $112,500 in 2020. This was more than double the estimate of the auction house. This colorway of the Jordan 7 was designed specifically for Jordan to wear in the Olympics, with his Team USA number 9 on the back of each shoe, as opposed to the 23 on other Jordan 7 colorways. According to Christie's, Michael Jordan wore these sneakers during the gold medal game against Croatia on August 8, 1992 in which Jordan scored 22 points and Team USA won by a score of 117 to 85. Although there is a new Space Jam movie starring contemporary basketball sensation LeBron James, the original Space Jam film from 1996 remains a millennial favorite. The popularity of the movie, as well as Michael Jordan's standing as a sports legend, was solidified by the selling of Air Jordan 11s produced specifically for the film. Sotheby's sold the Space Jam sample shoes as part of the MJ Secret stuff auctioned in collaboration with Project Blitz. Jordan never wore these shoes, but they were kept in excellent condition in a velvet lined handcrafted wooden box with a laser etched image of the Toon Squad emblem on the inner lid and Space jam on the outside. Jordan's autograph is also on the shoes. According to the Sotheby's, the Space Jam Air Jordans are among the rarest Air Jordans ever made, with only a few pairs in private collections. With a price tag of $132,000, the Bushaimi 100mm Diamond Shoes is currently the most expensive sneakers on the market. The sneakers are a limited edition of Bushaimi's well-known 100mm sneakers. The model is adorned with 11.50 carats of diamonds and the distinctive 18 carat gold hardware. The fact that the shoes are only available at Bushemi's main store in Manhattan added to their exclusivity. One pair of Bushemi 100mm diamond sneakers requires more than 20 hours of handwork. While these aren't the most expensive sneakers ever, the Michael Jordan Game 1 Converse are the most expensive pair of Converse shoes ever sold, selling for $190,373. Jordan wore these shoes during the 1984 Olympic gold medal game. Despite their significance in sports history, these Converse shoes are quite worn out. Jordan wore them throughout his college years. Michael Jordan gave these iconic Converse shoes to the 11-year-old son of Los Angeles Lakers legend Gil Goodrich. He cherished the sneakers until the day he decided to sell them. Prior to the recent sale of numerous pair of sneakers for millions of dollars, this rare pair of Nike Waffle Racing Flats were sold for $437,500, a record high for a pair of sneakers at that time. Nike co-founder Bill Bowerman created the Waffle Sold Running Shoes for the 1972 Olympic Trials. They are one of only 12 pairs ever made and the only on one set known to exist. Miles Nadal, a collector, purchased the shoes and intends to display them at his private museum in Toronto. The Waffle Racing Flats had a starting price of $80,000. By experimenting with his wife Waffle Iron, Bill Bowman was inspired to design the Waffle Soul Traction pattern. The rubber on the Waffle Racing Flats soles were literally poured in a customized Waffle Iron. Sotheby's sold off an autographed pair of Nike Air Jordan 1S, won by Michael Jordan in 1985 for $560,000 in 2020. The auction was held online in May 2020 and 10 buyers from around the world competed to acquire Jordan sneakers. 
The sneakers, according to the Saudi Bee's description, were designed exclusively for Jordan and included red laces rather than black and white. Unlike Jordan's subsequent sneakers, he wore a new pair for every game. These Nike Air Jordan 1S have been worn in. The shoes are also different sizes because Jordan wore a 13 on his left foot and a 13.5 on his right. This Nike Air Jordan 1S, worn by Michael Jordan, differed slightly from the initial line of Nike Air Jordans sold to the public. They are mid tops, which Nike did not produce for the public at the time, and the swatches are longer, leaner, and more aggressive. The next pair of shoes on this list have a place in sports history since they were worn by Michael Jordan in 1985 during a Nike exhibition game in which he dunked so hard that the glass backboard cracked. Christie's sold Jordan's Nike Air Jordan 1 for 615,000 US dollars in 2020, which was the highest price ever paid for a pair of sneakers at the time. Jordan signed the shoes, increasing their worth. Nike produced the limited edition shattered backboard in 2015 to honor Jordan's epic backboard shattering moment. The left shoe of Michael Jordan's Nike Air Jordan 1 eye shoes contains a fragment of glass from the backboard that Jordan smashed. As one of the most legendary athletes across any sport, Michael Jordan's memorabilia often fetches top dollar, particularly any sneakers that he personally wore. Several pairs of Jordan's sneakers have sold for tens of thousands of dollars. But a pair of Nikes he wore during his first season with the Chicago Bulls broke all of his previous sneaker records. Sotheby's auctioned off a pair of Nike airships that Jordan wore during his fifth NBA game on November 1, 1984, for roughly 1.5 million US dollars in October 2021. Jordan's Nike airships were sold off at Sotheby's in Las Vegas during the Icons of Excellence and Arts Luxury Auction. After the game, Michael Jordan's game won and autographed Nikes from 1984 were donated to Tommy Team 3 Lewis. Lewis saw the shoes in excellent condition, which likely contributed to the higher price paid for them. The very first pair of Yeezy sneaker prototypes, won by Kanye West at the 2008 Grammys, set a world record in April 2021 when they were sold in a private sale for 1.8 million US dollars. Sotheby's held the auction and the Nike Air Yeezy 1 prototypes were purchased by Rares, a sneaker investing platform. Sneakerheads say the shoes are so renowned because they inspired Kanye West to begin his Yeezy shoe and clothing line. Rares allowed customers to buy and sell shares in individual pairs of sneakers and shares for the Nike Air Yeezy 1 prototypes were made available to the public in June. Kanye West collaborated with Nike a few more times after the launching of the Nike Air Yeezy 1 in 2009 until breaking ties with the brand in 2013. Rapper Drake revealed in 2016 that he had obtained a unique pair of solid gold OVO Air Jordans worth 2 million US dollars, making them the most expensive sneakers ever sold in the world. Matt Senna, a mixed media and conceptual artist, designed the one-of-a-kind shoes. While the sneakers aren't really wearable because they were made of solid 24 karat gold, they are an exact replica of the OVO Air Jordans 10S, which sells for more than $600 on the secondary market. The solid gold OVO Air Jordans are worth around $2 million US dollars based on the price of gold, but Drake has not revealed how much he spent for the special shoes. Drake claims that the solid gold OVO Air Jordans weigh more than 100 pounds. 